When you put on the jersey, knowing all the players that have come before you and how rich the history is at the school and in this program, when you put on that jersey, it means a lot more than just the team you're playing for now. You're playing for all the alumni. You're playing for the institution. You're playing to kind of hold a very high standard that's, that's been around for as long as college hockey's been around. Harvard's men's hockey program dates back to 1898, lacing up the skates in its first intercollegiate game against Brown at Boston's Franklin Field. In 1904, two ice hockey rinks inside Harvard Stadium were constructed, allowing spectators to cheer on the Crimson. 1923 was the year that Harvard changed the game of hockey forever. Crimson head coach William Claflin and multi-sport letterman George Owen are credited with the infamous shift change, substituting entire forward lines instead of individuals. The shift change was revolutionary and remains how substitutions happen in today's hockey world. In 1956, the Donald C. Watson rink was built and has been home to the Crimson ever since. Though the rink has been renovated and renamed through the years, the location has remained the same. We've always been incredibly lucky to have tremendous facilities uh, for the hockey program here. Former star forward and Olympic medalist Bill Cleary took the helm as head coach in 1971. The winningest coach in program history, Cleary led the Crimson to the 1989 National Championship, defeating Minnesota 4-3 in overtime and claiming Harvard Hockey's first and only NCAA title. When you have a chance to win, you know, and, and be at the top of you know, the college game and, and win the last game of the season, there's a certain bond that you have with those players that goes far beyond, you know, who gets credit for a goal or assist. It really is just being part of that team and that experience. A history of successful players and teams have circulated through the program, earning nine ECAC tournament championships, 22 Ivy League championships, and 23 NCAA championship appearances. Striving for excellence not only on the ice but off the ice as a student is something that's highly valued and will continue to be passed on. We really want to keep that perspective uh, of having great kids that are truly representative of Harvard University and take great pride in the fact that they get to represent you know, this great university.